Ladies and gentlemen, this is not the normal way I start a day. Usually, I get out of that bed around 4pm, you know, something like that. Walk over to this window and say, wow, what an absolutely bloody lovely day it is in England right now. But I'm going to say, it's 7am. I have not been to sleep since 1.30. And I can't be asked sitting in bed doing nothing. So it's absolutely freezing cold outside. Like, it's genuinely freezing. There's frost on the glass. And I'm going to get changed, go on a bike ride, exhaust myself, come back and go to bed. So let's do it. FBI, open up! Oh. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Bike, are you ready to rock and roll? I'm hoping there's power in the electricity in your battery. Which I know kind of defeats the objective of uh, going on a bike ride, you know, for exercise and all the above and all that. But I'm just going because I cannot stand a second more of being in that bedroom. You know when it's just like you get past that point of being tired and you just... Really, really, really tired. Well, that's exactly what I've been for like the past six hours. So I've just had enough and uh, yeah, I'm going out and look at that. All the condensation on my car looks beautiful. All right, all right, all right, ladies and gentlemen. It's a fine ass morning. All right, let's go. Let's go on the road. Uh, completely forgot the fact that I chucked it down yesterday. So this ride that I'm gonna do, Oh God, oh God, it's gonna be, whoa, <laughs> hello, aren't you absolutely stunning, look at you, we cruising with no hands at 21 miles per hour, let's go, Woo. oh I think it's back to school time, the roads are most likely gonna be absolutely, oh here it is, look, the roads are gonna be rammed, there's a house down here that's being built, which is absolutely insane. Like, when I say this house you're about to see is insane, I mean, it's hands down the biggest house we're building in this area by far. Are you ready? Look at the size of that. Bloody hell, that's a nice house. Oh my God. That is nice, I don't even know what that is. But that, that's the great, it's got a triple garage at the back. Bro, whoever's house that is, let me say, that is absolutely stunning. I've now got to ride back up here around the corner, which I rode out my way just to show you that house. Get back up on here, get on the trail, keep going. When I said I can't sleep, I'm gonna go for a ride. I wanna go get stuck in a muddy bog. Right, I've got a mission. I wanna see this say 40 miles per hour today. Now I don't think I'll be able to do 40 down this path, but I do know of a few hills where we might be able to do it. So keep an eye on the speed boys. Oh, yeah, I'll grab a bottle of water. Yeah, I could have got a water, but then I got a Lucozade. Gotta stay loyal. But that said, fizzy orange Lucozade, psh, they change the flavour. Tastes like piss. I love that. Old traditional sort of like news agents rather than like a big corporate Tesco. Don't get me wrong, Tesco's got way more stuff, but it's nice, isn't it? Support a little local business. Right, let's go around Gumstall. This is, where, uh, this is where I used to come as a kid and uh, we'd walk around Constal feeding the ducks and it was bloody lovely. Oh look, the swans are out. You ever want to take someone on a date somewhere? This is the perfect spot. Feed the ducks, nice and romantic. Pretty damn peaceful. And yet again, another factory looking like it's just going to waste. It's not fair. I actually, uh, fun story, rang the people who own this building about whether or not it was for sale, 
and they never got back to me. I do know that there's businesses that run out of there because look how many stories it is. But like, oh, look at that. Oh my God, it's massive. Mate. Hey, calm down, calm down, mate. Chill out, it's fine. Fat bastard. Good size of you. You need to lay off the loaf, mate. Look at it. That entire top floor. Just doing nothing and going to waste. Oh, what I'd do for that. What I would do for that. <laughs> Sexual favours the lot. Excuse me, coming through. Excuse me, coming through. Excuse me, coming through. <laughs> go, 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 go. Attack, attack, attack. <laughs> <laughs> me, you're not part of that crew. That's the black and stripy crew, not the not the white crew. Wait, that just sounded racist. That sounded, sound, that sounded totally racist and it was not meant to in the slightest. But look at this. How is this just on my doorstep? Look at that. Look at this. Look at that. <laughs> I have been thwarted. The path stops and leads me to stairs. Ugh. All good things must come to an end. And that means the end of my uh, enjoyable bike ride because this bike is too bloody heavy. Oh my God, this is, mate, this bike. Bloody, Jesus. This thing's, this is my only exercise out this entire ride. Oops. Oh, now they put a thorn in it. Right. Wait, is there fishes over there? Hmm. Looks like fishermen. Who comes fishing at eight o'clock in the morning? Then again, you could say who comes on a ride, bike ride at eight o'clock in the morning, but you know, even's even. Look at me go. Look at me. I'm like a, I'm like a Casey Neistat. However, I don't do shots like that all the time just because I can't be asked having to return and come and get in the camera. So come on now. Come on now, let's go. Now I was told not to tell you this, but boo, because you don't say boo to a goose. That's the entire reason I came on this bike ride, just so I could say boo to a goose. And yes, I'm aware, I look like a pleb with these glasses on, but hey, it stops cow poo going in my eyeballs. All right, steady now, <laughs> steady now. Whoa. Whoa, slippy. Oh God. Don't touch the brakes. All right. This, ladies and gentlemen, is like my local area's version of Niagara Falls. Now, brace yourselves because you're about to be wooed. It's about to get noisy. Ladies and gentlemen, on your left, you will see Jai, Jai Rack Falls. <laughs> That's mental, man. As a kid, I always got told that there was a troll that lived inside that cave and it always, always terrified me as a kid. Wow. Pretty beautiful, even though it's just water falling. Pretty damn beautiful. And also, I talked about this in the vlog not too long ago. There was a, a rave uh, last weekend, which I believe was here. It was called like the Moving Festival. And apparently it had some really big names here. Well, well, I say really big, I have no idea. But, I'm a, yeah, I'm, a, I'm assuming this is, this is where they held it. Mate, maybe, if, oh yeah, look at mate, bloody hell. Boys, let's get on it. Round two. Sunday club. Nah, we've got Monday club, look at this. Mate, kegs for days. I'm going to assume they've been drunk, but you never know. You never know. I'm going to assume the stage was there. This is the, oh yeah. Whoa. This is the bar. What the hell? Oh, well, there's a farm back here. I don't even have an idea. Oh, wait. I better not be on a farm. Am <laughs> I about to get shot? Is it? You, what the hell? You won't believe what happened. This YouTuber got shot. Oh, whoa. That's where the rest of the festival was. Oh, there's a monster alive in there. Whoa. Look at this! There's a full like bar or something down here. I'm gonna go investigate and hopefully, you know, not get shot. Listen to how long I skid for when I break. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Whoa! Apparently you could do a uh, glamping here. If you don't know what that means, it means glamorous camping. Whoa! Wait, there's a. This is dope. Oh, I like that. Them signs are well good. They got the deers. Is that the Manchester Bee? Oh, it is, isn't it? Whoa. I, I am absolutely gutted. I didn't come down to this. This is dope. 
Oh my God, this just makes me want to buy land again, even more so. Look at this, just having land and being like, look at that. Look at, I mean, look at this. I'm definitely, I'm definitely on someone's private property right now. Ah, there's the house. I'm probably not supposed to be here. So I'm gonna go ahead. Dude, that looks like a shell, like a chalet straight out of France. Blackthorn Angus. This looks like a chalet. Look at the, look at the design in that. Mate, that is something else. The only thing it's let itself down with is not having a thatch root. Mate, it's straight out of Lord of the Rings. That is absolutely gorgeous. Whoever made that is a... This has been like Tom's local house tour. That's amazing. And they've got a boat under it. <laughs> Wicked. And a tree swing over there. Oh my God, did I, I found my local village's uh, <laughs> Niagara Falls. <laughs> oh, damn it, what's that place called in Lord of the Rings? Oh, I'm letting myself down here. In Lord of the Rings where they all live, Frodo and all them. No, oh, I forgot, damn it. But that's, that's our version of it. <laughs> Whoa, look at that. Yo, that's amazing. I think, I, I want to say it's either a woodpecker or like a little hummingbird or something, but that's why, what I want to do with my tree at my house, get it carved into something. Obviously I can't do like a you know, beak or anything because I don't have a branch sticking off it, but that's wicked. Oh my God. I mean, I need to move, <laughs> I need to move house. I just need to move to somewhere where I've got space. Imagine this was your garden. Just a defender driving around all... So just go and buy the house off them. Oi! <laughs> is it for sale? <laughs> I want to... What is it called where Frodo Baggins lives? What is it called? The Shire! <laughs> yes! The Shire! I'm going to buy this place. All my family can live up there. Syndicate Original. We can have a bar. I can do parties for you guys. You host festivals. This truly is an absolutely mega spot. And you've got Gyrac Falls. Amazing. All right, back onto the ride we go. I'm just making it up as I go along at this point. But, eh, you know, I guess that's how bike trails get made. Someone just goes, I wonder what's up there. They go up there and, hey presto, they've invented a new ride. I'll tell you a fun fact though. When I was a kid, uh, wait, people made bridges. A little bit. Do you know what, I'm going to assume, because I saw some bushes collapsed over there, I think this is where people built a bridge to, to sneak onto the site, because they didn't want to pay. I think I've sussed that out. Well, that's quite nice. Uh, but as a kid, I came racing down that hill, right? Fully flying down, and I smacked right into that tree. Because I either had the choice, because I couldn't, I couldn't slow down enough, it was either go off the edge into loads of bramble bushes, right? Straight into the bushes and off the verge, or hit the tree. And um, well, I picked the tree, obviously, because I didn't want to go in the bushes. And oh my God, did it hurt. I nearly knocked myself unconscious. Let's get up this hill. <laughs> I like how I'm making sound effects as if it's a struggle when, in fact, I just put it into a lower gear and the electric engine just goes, Zleep. Well, I thought my off piste is it called off piste or off peak? Off piste, piste? Off the path adventure would be good idea, but then, I'm not, I've not got a puncher yet, but look at the size of those, those thorns. Hmm. This isn't such a good idea. Oh dear, oh dear. And this <laughs> is dangerous territory. Look at the amount of roots. Scrooge. What is this way? Ah, my thorns! <laughs> Mate, this is just dangerous in general. Big, big stump. Whoop. All right, what's occurring round here then? Oh, look at that. Oh my God, someone's made a den. I was gonna say it's poisonous berries, but your den was all good until you gave it away with the bright orange thing. Just saying, kids. Can we get a five second countdown timer? until uh, I say I've got a puncture and I'm pushing my bike home. In five, four, three, two, one. The truly best thing about an electric bike is exactly this. I would not want to come riding up here because of all the hills and stuff, but I really don't care about them. So I can just fly up them, check out a trail. If it leads nowhere, 
just ride back up it with ease. But oh my God, look at this place. Look at this place. I've not been here since I was like a kid riding around here. Mate, it's magical. I'm well glad I got out of bed. I want to say, oh my God, do you know what I want to say? I've got a feeling if any of you viewers from like two years ago remember, I almost bought some land. I swear this is like on the back of that land. Imagine if I could just bought that land, or if I did, the thing is you couldn't build on it and the neighbours, I would have just got noise complaints. And then just be able to ride down here and have a trail going straight through the woods. I'd be, oh, there are them berries. Poisonous berries. But I think there's a trail there that I'm gonna go down, check it out. But I want to ride to the end of this path and see where it takes me. And uh, again, update. No puncher, no way, not yet. No thank you. Not yet, I mean like no way at all. Why am I even encouraging it? I've made it to the top and you will not believe it. You will not believe it. This is the area. That land I wanted to buy is literally there. No way. Oh, good. Should have just bought it. It was like 40 grand. Land does nothing but go up in value. But right. I know I sound exhausted because this thing is amazing. But you do have to do some of the work. But right. I said I wanted to hit 40 miles per hour. And I think we're gonna do it here. That is, if I don't get a puncture. Oh, you know, no pressure. No pressure not to get a puncture. All right. <laughs> Tokyo drift line there. Now there's no way I'm getting 40 mile per hour. I'll dip one of them barges too hard, but right, which way am I going now? Is this it? No, it's further down. Away she blows. Let's keep her going. Mate, we can easily do it. I think the most I've done on this bike is 47 miles per hour. That's the first time I've been down there. That was good fun that. Right, is this a trail? Um kinda looks like one, but it was a better one here. Chances are if it's good, if it's been walked on, there's not gonna be brambles everywhere. Here you go, here it is. Alright. Let's do this. Mysterious hill section number one. What do you have to offer me? Hey? Any tree roots? <laughs> Mate. The amount of mud that just went in my mouth there and was hanging. So let's restart. All right, I should really trail this first. Check it out, because it clearly is a bike track. I can see tire marks going down it. All right, let's not talk. Let's keep our mouth closed. See ya. <laughs> Mate, let's check that out. Whoa, that is gnarly. Look at that. Whoa, that is like black ice for a car. You smack that wrong, you're going sideways. I'm not being rude, lads, but I think I might avoid that. Seen it in like the military where they take down a dead tree. <laughs> What's this? That's what I thought. <laughs> Someone give that. Look at how steamy it gets in these glasses. <laughs> Can I see? Oh mate, I'm still tasting dirt from when I came down that trail. It just went <laughs> straight into the back of me. Alright. Whoa! Mate, that wet root there just, just almost had me off. Alright. This is where I wish I didn't wear clippings sometimes. Thank you. Mate, I actually can't see. Look at my glasses. Look how steamed up they are. I can't see through them. Oh my 
Mate, that, that is just nasty. Alrighty. Right, tree. Tree root. Be kind to... Whoa! <laughs> Went sideways straight away. Oh, look at it. Look at that. Back tie went straight away. You naughty, naughty root. That's well better. Oh, and another one. And away she blows. Mate, look at my tires. Hello. I've got absolutely no grip on them whatsoever. Oh, look where it's, look where it's brought me out. No way. <laughs> We came full circle. Brilliant. Now, let's see if I can 200 IQ this. You ready? Right, go on. Yeah, oh my. <laughs> right, I don't know how deep that is. I put it there. Oh, yes. Yeah. 200 IQ. <laughs> Thank you, drunk, drunk break and entry people. You just helped me get across. <laughs> Mate, look at me. I'm absolutely filthy. Mate, I want to come back and do that on a dry day. That'd be well fun. Glasses, you are going back on. Amount of mud coming off that front tyre. Whoa. <laughs> Jesus on a bike. Goodbye, troll. Goodbye, Gyracra Falls. Till next time. Weeping Willow, cute little area. This is great. What a productive Monday morning this has been. To say I was absolutely raging that I didn't have a good night's sleep. This is proper made up for it. And I tell you what, I'm gonna give you a bonus. Watch this. Ready? I'm gonna go this way because, ladies and gentlemen, I don't know if you know, you know, guys, I'm like mega famous. World, scroll, world star famous Tom Cassell got my own street named after me. Oh my God. <laughs> and apparently there's my defender. But look, Thomas Street. And okay, just for the record, that may be a fib. I didn't have a street named after me. It's just pretty cool though, isn't it? Pretty goddamn dope. Mate, that's a nice defender. Just, just like mine actually, 14 plate. Nice. Now for the super, super fun part. <laughs> of which, I, as a kid, I'd be crying. Nice uh, carving of an owl there. As a kid, I'd be crying, because I've now got to ride up that hill that we did 39 miles per hour down. But with this thing, look at it, it's a doddle. An absolute doddle. <laughs> hey, electric bikes, man. Wait, what? I'm on a hill! <laughs> I found it! No way. I found the Young Farmers Show, or whatever it's called. Oh, nice. I found it. Here's the bar. This is the marquee for it. How do I get in? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm a farmer. I've got, a, I've got a defender. Let me in. I am a bogus farmer, and I'm here to ransack your farm. Literally two seconds later, I found it. Whoa. Is it opening? Is it closed? What time does it start? It said the first, wait, what day is it? Wait, is it not, is it bin? This looks like it's bin. Oh, it's the second, sorry. I'm going now. Apologies. Okay, I'm late. Hang on a minute. This isn't a farmer's market. There's no, there's no defenders. Bogus, bogus I tell you. Now as hills go, this is probably one of, if not the steepest hills my entire area and my bike is whining like crazy because it's like just let me stop no way but mate even with the motor whew, to think my dad as a kid used to force me to ride up this the entire time i was like i don't like you i'm not your son but hey dad look at me now i'm cheating mother Nice. Sell me your land. I'll take it. And I'll take that. I'm dreaming of a beautiful day. 
And I'm having myself a brilliant day For I am riding through my local village, yes I, I'm like mixing songs here Hide, cricket hands What the hell is squash? You see, I got a predicament now I either go that way, down towards Alice's and my dad's Or, I go that way and I can do a bit of downhilling Hmm, I got four miles left on the bike Ah, let's do it both <laughs> Wait, hold up, hold up Ladies and gentlemen, to continue the, uh, the tour of Gyrak Well, let's hope no one's in that car, because that's a bit awkward um, Welcome to what is known as um, the Shaggers Quarry I don't, I, I'm not sure if that's its actual name But uh, apparently this is known as the spot where people come to doggy um, If you're a, a dirty doggier then uh, I'm not telling you the location, you can piss off Or you probably already know of it, but Yeah, apparently this is where people come doggy in Can't say I've ever uh, partaken in that in my life And they're probably still at it <laughs> Or them But uh, yeah, what a weird little uh, thing to have in Gyrak But hey, there's, there's shotgun robberies there's, there's all sorts Here you go, Gyrak You know, if there ever comes a time in my life Where I, I decide to try and sell my house I'm gonna have a bad time, aren't I? Because <laughs> The only thing everyone ever knows about my local area is that there was a mass murderer here, there was the Moors murderers, the, you know, there's always robberies, and I call it Gyrak. Like, I, I'm, really, I'm really not adding to the, the value of the land, but... Uh, take it as what it is. You may recognise this ride from such other videos as... Oh my god, I'm back on the bike again! But yes, ladies and gentlemen, this is the same location from that. Also, another beautiful house being built up there. Bit bit of a dangerous spot, seems though it's next to a golf course, so bloody hell <laughs> It's next to a golf course with windows that big Mate, they better get some like plastic sheeting on that or something, but Right, we're not going to do the same ride as last time We're going to go down here uh, And then we're going to flick a left And go down Werner Flow rather than down towards Hattersley So we're going to go this way And uh, it'll be a bit faster than loose, so uh Let's send it when we get there Selling shotguns? <laughs> I'm not selling any <laughs> The disrespect. The goddamn. Who did they? I'm gonna go shout at someone. I'm gonna find just some random person and be like, hey, close the gate! Close the gate! Wait, what's that say? There is a right of way over the golf course. Okay, that's good to know. Well, that guy could have walked down the path, but he chose the golf course. Okay. But look at me, being a good citizen, closing the gate. Also, fun story in the life of Tom. This is called Werner Flow, and that's the cenotaph where you pay the respects. On uh, what is it? Remembrance Sunday and stuff like that. No, just in general. But this is where you used to come and play as a kid. Win a flow. Beautiful area, lovely. Nothing bad to report about this. Tell you what, this will add some value back to the land. But on my birthday, right? When um, when it was my birthday as a kid. Wait, are you recording upside down? Wait, how did? Really, come on. How's that happen? How are you upside down? Right, but anyway, as a kid. Wait, do I have to? Uh, Ryan will fix it. Right, as a kid. Right. We used to come up here at midnight and we'd come up here at midnight and we'd all play hide and seek and you have to like our return hide and seek return whatever it was so say that bench was the spot you have to you'd go run off and you'd have to hide and then if you're the last one left you have to try and make it back to basically we just played hide and seek but look how sick of a place it was to hide just keeps going and going and going loads of bramble bushes and stuff to hide in mate it was epic can can you explain why you're upside down i don't, I don't understand lovely hey thanks for that sun's coming out makes a bloody change Right, let's let's get up this hill and let's send it. But yeah, this was just like an awesome little place to come and uh, play as a kid, hide and seek. Fun story, me, my dad and my sister camped uh, just behind them spiky bushes over there once. We just randomly came out and slept under the stars. Lovely. Hey, what a nice spot. I do love my local area. I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't change it for anything. Seriously. Wait, I can't tell if someone's put the sign there whether or not this is actually a bike repair shop. What? Wait, is there a bike repair shop around the back? I'm confused. I'm very, very confused. Is your house a shed? <laughs> right, we gotta go up here now. Let's do it. Oh, look where we are. <laughs> you guys may know that as the shaggy place. But we're back. Ta-da! I'm not joking when I say this. This is the road to get 40 miles per hour on. Going down. No cars that way. No cars coming up. All right, let's see if we can get 40. Ready?
<laughs> no joke, I'm now gonna ride back up the hill because <laughs> I reckon I can get 50 out of it. So let's do this. All right, dramatic bars, black and white, epic music time. All right, 50 miles per hour. Yes. so far. I feel like if we had a bit more of a run up, we could have absolutely nailed that. Uh, mate, I don't know if you saw it on camera, but you see that car come out? Four. That would have been me dead. Completely. Alright, next stop. Hopefully breakfast with Kenneth. Mm -hmm. It is currently 9.16. Let's see if Kenneth He's a week for some breakfast. Oh, right, right. oh no. Kenneth! 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 What are you doing? Kenneth! Sure, I've been mountain biking now, eh? Kenneth! Can I have a screw for this, please? Kenneth! Have you had any breakfast yet? I have, mate. I'm going to work. What are you doing? You're not going to give me a bowl of fruit and fibre? You can have a bowl of fruit and fibre. Hey. You want, mate? Yeah? Have you got fruit and fibre? Just like that? Yes. Uh, yes. Pull up that chair for me, get me a bowl of cereal. I'm <laughs> joking. <laughs> Mate, I've had a well good day. Please, sir, can I have a bowl of fruit and fibre? <laughs> what, you got orange juice? Oh, well, <laughs> got my boat, I got my, got my punting hat on. What a lovely day, Love, what a lovely day. <laughs> I love how I'm just coming to harass my dad for a bowl of cereal. I do have cereal and milk at my house, but I just figured I'd come and have it with you. Oh, no, wait, I don't want no crunchy nut. Fruit and fibre. <gasps> you know what? Wait, I tell you, I'm going to save the day because I really want fruit and fibre. Yeah. I know you've got some in that camper pan. You might not, yeah. <laughs> you really didn't expect me coming this morning, did you? <laughs> um, I don't know. I saw you been out there again. I thought you Oh, did you see? Yeah. Oh, that's the good stuff. Oh. <laughs> Stash. Oh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh, ladies and gentlemen, the good stuff. I've seriously disturbed my dad's morning. He was about to go to work. I pulled the chair outside, brought me a bowl of fruit and fibre and a glass of orange juice. Oh, this is the life. Cheers. Oh, I love it. I feel like I'm 12 again. <laughs> Mate, this is it. This is this is the be this has been the best Monday morning of my life. <laughs> get, a, get a free service. Got a cup of tea, I've had some cereal. I'm loving it. Oh mate, he's proper committed. It's there. Ah. We've committed, we've, <laughs> we, I need a, I'm missing a screw for this. It's loose, so <laughs> Ken's gonna fix it. Do you know what, I, I feel like I'm doing a, oh, what's it called, like a boxcar challenge. I'm trying to get my bike up to speed. I tried to get it for the 50 miles per hour down the road today. 50, did I just try to get 50? Yeah, I tried to get 50, didn't I? So my dad and I, we've decided, it, the only reason we didn't get 50 mile per hour is because aerodynamics. the aerodynamics are broken because this panel is loose. So, because we fixed it, look at this. Look at this, Ken, the man of me Ken. Wrong screw. No. <laughs> it's supposed to be bigger. Is it not fit? It, it's too short, it's too small. What's a bigger screw? Oh, no. It's only, that's only about two. I don't know, it could be three mil. It wants to be a bigger well, screw. We think once we get I'll this panel closed, it'll be capable of 50 mil per hour. <laughs> I tell you something, what we can look at whilst we're around here. Where is it? Where is it? There. Oh my gosh, ladies and gentlemen. The MMM 3000. So many people ask me about this thing. Have you still got it? Have you still got it? Now the answer is... 
haven't. I don't actually. Because don't. all right, I tell you what, I'm not going to open it now because I've got water. There's water everywhere. I don't want to risk it spilling into it. Damn it. Hey up, Ken's Ken's doing the business. Go on then. After all these years, no way. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the MMM three thousand box. No way. No way. Wait, you can hear it. Where's the speaker? Yeah. Oh, no, it's at the back. <laughs> Oh my god! How is it possibly still working after all this time? Oh my goodness me. If you guys have no idea what this... How is there still some in it? Man, that's probably poisonous now. If you guys have no idea about the MMM 3000, seriously. Um, Orion, let's throw up a clip of like when I first ever opened it when I was younger. What? Oh my god! That's incredible! Oh my god! Look at that! That's so cool! Damn, look at that! That looks so cool! When the military came and dropped it off at my actual house, I know, they dropped it off at my house, it was the craziest thing ever. It was a brand deal, like, you know how I do like brand deals with, uh, you know, like, say, LG or something like that? Well, I did a brand deal with um, Fridge Raiders, the Chicken Bites, and that, honestly, it was, the, the, the brand deal was so successful, like, it got so many views, it was just incredible. Like, it, it was just a massive accomplishment for the time. Um, it won a Cannes Lion Award in marketing. So I could actually say I won a Cannes Lion Award for marketing, which is pretty goddamn impressive. But yeah, how amazing is that? That after all this time, my, I, was th I was thinking of making a standalone video on my main channel about the MMM 3000. Because I get so many questions being like, Tom, do you remember the gaming helmet? Tom, do you remember the gaming helmet? And I always was like, oh, I'll go down to my dad's because he's got the, it's called a Pelican box. That He's still got the Pelican box. I was like, I'll go down and check it out and see if like, you know, what, what state it's in and everything. And it just happened to be that my dad filmed it and put it on Twitter and was like, oh, you'll remember this. I was like, I couldn't believe that. So I just thought I'd show you guys there. To everyone who asked me, by the way, where the helmet is, whoever the fan was who designed the actual helmet, because the, the way it all came about is, Fridge Rager said to me, my, they want my audience to create a gaming helmet that helmet that dispenses food and someone created like a you know you know a, a, like a revolver a revolving chicken canister that we press a button it turns the chicken releases comes down opens up and you eat it like nom 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 around if you could show a clip of it actually working now gonna press the paddle which we've got should probably be on the floor but i'm just pressing it for now down one comes into the slot Ooh. And it actually works. That is how awesome it was. Now, it was never supposed to be a real thing. And it was just supposed to be like a fun little thing for my audience and these like designers to create. But the, the, the fan who designed it, once I gave it back to them, they like came and collected it. The fan who designed it got to keep the helmet. Now, I don't actually know who the fan was who won it. But whoever it was out there, if you can somehow get in touch with us and you still got it, can I see it? If not, can I obtain it off you? One way or another, I want to try and get the MMM 3000 back because that thing needs putting in a museum. Hey up. Now. Is that the right one? The proper screw. All right, here we go. Are we spray painting it black? <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, the test. Will my bike go even faster? I reckon it will. I reckon it'll help. There we have it. You are just a proper man, aren't you? You're the definition of a man. Done. Look how proud he is of himself. Job done. <laughs> we will get the speed. I might actually drive. I might ride up Joel Lane now, just to try and get fifty miles per hour out of it. Won't pop apart anyway. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. The speed. The need for speed. <laughs> Stay. Ken. Ken's shop today has been. What can I do for you? Come right. Genuine question. If I could do one thing right now to make your life amazing, what would it be? No wheels on the car. <laughs> I'll ring a guy right now. Tell you what, Dad, we'll do it. I'm gonna make a phone call and I'm getting I'm gonna get his wheels refurbed. <laughs> what are you doing? Sit on there. What? Sit on there. Okay. <laughs> now just by rocking your head, it'll start spinning. But lean your head out. Am I gonna fall off? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> just lean your head. 
Just, you just gotta link the other side of it and go backwards, and it'll go. Go on, keep going. <laughs> go on, watch. How is this? Just, just your head. Uh, oh my god. Wait, your head. <laughs> Wait, how is it? Oh, it's well, I've mastered it. Head, I've mastered it. Oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, my head, my head, my head, my head. Could you? Wait, wait how have you done it? It's, it's just balance, isn't it? Ready? Oh, okay. I'm doing it now. There you go. All right, ready? Wait, which one I get? The... There. <laughs> Put 10 pence in the meter. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right. Now, Try it the other way now. No way, no way. Yeah. Not like leading oh, up. It's on the perfect one. angle, isn't it? Yeah, it's just perfect. All right, there you go. So we've spoke to Wheels. Wheels is uh, going to give you a phone call today, and you're going to get a new set of wheels. I've got to go to work, High fives. Mate. Yeah, Alice is going to be like, to to Dad, you were supposed to be here at 9 a.m. No, I've, I've kind of distracted him for the past uh, like half an hour. So. Sorry about that. Sorry, Alice. Hang on a minute. My dad said, my dad said, put my bike in here, and then he said, get a, get a shirt out of there. Any shirt. Okay. He said, all right, this will do. Get a shirt, any shirt. All right. All right. This is not a Greg Minar shirt. It's just a random top. Is that all right? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what he's doing. Oh, stay. Oh, my head's gone sideways now, spinning on that. Oh, it was all fun and games spinning, but I started picking up some serious speed. Now my head's gone sideways. Boo. Okay. Put on. Oh, you want me to wear it? Oh, I thought you were going to do a magic trick or something. No, I am. You're going to get a clean shirt on. Okay. Oh, right. Are we going? Yeah. Oh, right. Okay. I just said to my dad, do you know why I'm so happy today? He went, why? And I said, because of Ryan's back. And speak of the bloody devil, he's literally just texted me. I, I haven't read what he said yet, but he's just texted me. And uh, my dad just said, take, 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 take your shirt off so you're clean. Sit on the towel. We're going to go. We're gonna, he's going to take me to magical land or something. Um, and we're going we're gonna to be doing a day in the life of Ken. I'll mince that. I should, we should actually proper do that, like a full day. A day in the life of Ken. Cool keep up, I really couldn't actually. <laughs> if it involves a bike, if it involves a bike without an electric engine, no way. Oh, yeah, well. i tell you something, sir. This, blacked out wheels, painted calipers. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, suits you, sir. You know, you know, I said Orion text me. He said, yeah, can you pay me? <laughs> I forgot to set up his auto payback again. <laughs> Sorry! Wait, is that where you work? Joseph Adams? Joseph Adams, yeah. When, when you were how old? 15 to 17. Whoa. Where's Dad, Keith? Yeah. Oh, wow. These are cranes here, these are cranes. Yeah, no, I remember you bringing me here. You some cranes and you, you operated them. The other one, there was two of them. Yeah. One of them you operated it on streams. Yeah, I remember the flower shop, yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, we've been here before, this is mega. Dope. China shop, florists, <laughs> golden trees, big random trees. Whoa. Can you, t can you ask me if I can buy this factory? Imagine owning this space. I'll have a zip wire. Oh, old school. We've turned up looking like a pe an episode of the Peaky Blinders to fix my dad's tubing and it, <laughs> our heads have fallen off. We're like, we don't know how to do it. The reason why I remember coming here it's because of that exact thing there. Someone randomly with a quad bike just chilling up there. Why? I don't, I don't, I don't get it. This place is a maze. So can you just rent space here? Yeah. Floor space, yeah. Who, who actually owns the building? Yeah, yeah, because I remember all these cars. Someone just stores the cars down here. MGB. They just go into waste back here, aren't they? Oh, look at it. Look at the poor car. My TT looked like that a few days ago. <laughs> what is it? A TVR Turbo. Whoa. Oh, poor things, just getting ruined. Same Oh, it's not getting rained on. Hey, tell me, tell me you're not tempted. They, they've, they've boarded up the ladders all the way over. That's just crazy. That's kind of weird. Must be a brewing company around here or something. Hey, it's not the only keg I've seen this morning. It's a sign the world wants me to drink. Wait, wait, stop. T t stop now, you can see it. You telling me you can't see it, what I'm what I'm thinking of. That one post? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. The, the angle of it. No, the actual post, let's take it and put it in my garden. 
Telegraph Do you met the telegraph pole? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. When, when I was a yeah, kid, my dad bought quid, one yeah. of them off someone when they were taking it down for how much? You can get for about 20 quid. 20 quid. quid. And we put it in the garden. You see the pegs on it? We used to have yeah. it as a climbing like yeah. pole in the background, didn't we? A totem yeah. pole. Yeah. How have I not got one of them in my garden? Well, I don't know. You never asked for one. <laughs> we <laughs> needs to change that. And the Mustang just hit it right here. Mel, been on such an adventure today. A day in the life of Ken. I love it. Welcome to Providence Mill. Open to the public. Oh, look at it, Dad. Look at it. Look at it. Right, listen up, Mr. Providence. I'm going to ring him and see if I can buy it off him. You got to eat bigs every meal, sir. Well, <coughs> yeah. I could keep them. I could keep them in. Yeah, see, this is actually kind of the perfect one. I've said this before because it's not actually too big. And it's not in an area, and it's already like fenced up and gated up. You won't have to, you won't have to throw a lot of money at it. Look at it. I've got a gym in it. Booming. Well, Kenneth, I can confirm that was an absolutely lovely morning. Hey, breakfast was on me. Breakfast on me. <laughs> hey, and the wheels were on me. I'll be, in, I'll be in touch. There you go. Look at that. Treating, treating old Kenneth. I can't believe it. I've had such an amazing, productive morning. And I thought, you know what? I'll go to the office. They're not even in. They're not even, it's half past 10 and they're not even in. And thus, my ride comes to an end with two miles left on the battery. By the way, this thing can like, I think do 25, 20, something like that, it's crazy. And it wasn't fully charged, but, oh, <laughs> wait, look, when I put it up into the highest mode, it was like, nope, you have one mile left. With one mile left, We've made it home, ladies and gentlemen. We've made it home. I am pretty sure I have a guest at my house. Where is he? Where is he? Where is my bogus gas man? <laughs> Look, he's got his little office set up and everything. Where is he? Is he digging at my house? <laughs> Damn, baby girl, you looking hella clean. However, I noticed within the one day of getting it washed, a spider has made a web over the entire thing. Look, even coming out of the exhaust. Stop it! All right. Where is the man of bogusness? Mr. Gasman. Holy ducks. Well, that's one way to keep me awake. Bloody hell. Oh, I think I may have just shit myself. I need the toilet. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, that's the last ride we ever go on. It's broke. <laughs> um, this was corroded, so we put some WD-40 on it to clean it up, but it looks a bit rusted. And now when I plug it back in, um, t t this, it, th this is the most stupid plug. In the <laughs> Basically, it's not charging. So we're never going on a bike ride again. Yay! It's, it's, it's FaceTiming a customer and there's me slapping my naked leg. Oh, I love it. Showered and changed. Oh, yes, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I'm not ready yet, but oh, look at that. Sure, goddamn. Cynic original, goddamn. I said, goddamn, we got the Ace shirt looking good. Get yours right now, syndicateoriginal.com. That is more like it. Oh, we feeling fresh, we feeling good. Ladies and gentlemen, you ready to start this day? Oh, hold up, wait a minute. Already started. Now, we did think the day would just like, you know, pan out whatever next, but the adventure continues because Kenneth Dottus Kaselov has required my help. So we're going to go and get Ken because he needs some vehicle with space. And I have a vehicle with the biggest booty in town. So we're going to be taking that to Alice's house, where my father is, because when we get there, he needs us. I'm not too sure why, but we'll find out when we get there. All right, you. You listen up, and you listen good. We're going to start first f***ing time, all right? First time. Sick of this. Keep having me off. But watch this space. We can do this. All right, ladies and gentlemen. By order 
of the Peaky Porkers. You will start first top. I forgot I had it in gear. <laughs> Step one on the Ken Adventure, what are we doing? Join me today. <laughs> Why are we doing joinery? Oh yeah, a day in the life of Ken continues. <laughs> oh. I urge you the man to go for for wood. And you've got a lot of it. Bloody hell, that's a big one. Right, Kenneth, what are you doing with a piece of wood that big? Skirting boards around now, this is chimney breast. Oh, wow, skirting boards. That's what I've got to do with. Right. Oh, no, I'm going to bring it back. Oh, the end of it. oh, look at that. Ken's got an eye for it, look at that. As Ken would say, I thought he said, it shagged. Right. It was. <laughs> <laughs> it was. You're a shagged piece of wood, you are. I, was, I said to him, no way it's not going to fit. Turns out, it fits absolutely perfect. Nice. The man with the van. All right, you watch yourself. I wouldn't want you getting a splinter. No. But talk about success. I've needed for ages a tape measure. And I've got one. This has been the... Right, we're in. Do not smash my windows. It's broken enough. This has been the most successful Monday of my life. All right, stage two. We are getting the dehumidifier from uh, my dad's neighbours. We get the dehumidifier. De we get that, we take it up to our and cows, we suck the air, the water out the air uh, so it can be painted, I believe, and then we're sorted. We're just waiting for Ken. Oh, the man with the plan is back. Okay, let's take a look at this. It's a piece of magic. What it does, you put it in a room, you turn it on, you secure the room tightly, and it sucks the uh, the air in, and it drains out the liquid, of which it sounds like he's draining it as we speak. Give it like water. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good job, good job, good job. We've got a room. Oh, wow, look at that old piece of kit. Is that yours? Yeah. How long have you had that for? Oh, 20 years. Oh, they're nearly older than me. Oh. Told you, my dad. My, my dad is the man who can do everything and anything. I love him. Tom's Defender Taxi Services are at an end. Wait, do you need to go anywhere else? Or anything else? No, just stop. What? If you speak to Carl, he needs to get in here, start cleaning plastic up in there. <laughs> so you've been a busy man. It looks nice, that. Whoa, the flags. Yeah, it looks really good. good. Yeah, I'm going to have a look at the bathroom. You're right, it does smell of food. I wonder if he's honestly been and fed the cat. Oh, stinks. It rain. Whoa. 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 All right, all right. I shall bring the bud in. Have a smell of banana. No. Yarp. What, what, what's different than that when it's on there? Not at all. Not even in the slightest. It's right, high. What's the difference? Can you tell me? <laughs> you see it? Uh, no, you wouldn't notice. Difference in that tongue there. Alright, <laughs> 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 fist bump, I'm off. Yeah. I'm going to get some dinner. Uh, uh, mate, <laughs> keep, keep, keep me posted if I need to continue <laughs> the day in the life of Ken. That's the same as you're on the kick. Okay, so. Yeah. The man with the plan. Alright, see you later. I'm putting money on it right now, he's gonna show me a drill. <laughs> I just said I just said I put money on it, he's showing me a drill. Screwdriver. Wow, how's the drill kit? Hey, where's my drill bits? Yeah. I bought this as well. Mate, what a successful day. I got drill bits for my new drill that Ken bought me. Oh I bought, sorry. Ken just got me a good deal. And I do not need all these, so I'll take half of them. So you've got to sleep there. I'll sleep there. Yeah. You can put whatever you want in. Ooh. I've been here outside the bloody pie shop for ages. It was absolutely rammed. But I've got the order in. Food is being prepared. And I am hungry. Me, do you know how much I love you? I waited there for like 20 minutes to get food. Then I hear things like egg, get out of my face, man. Do you, know, do you know why? Look at look at the colour of that egg. It's Lovely. so raw. <sighs> and then, do you know why? Because that's for two eggs as well. Oh. I said, no one use extra egg. Smells like a 
You know, like a mud bath that you go in that proper stinks. If you've ever been to Turkey and you've been in a mud bath, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Do you know what? If I weren't going to a Stop breathing! <laughs> if I weren't, if I wasn't... Stop it! <laughs> Fire! I'm moving, Ryan's right, right back! Fire! <laughs> If I wasn't going to this wedding, you know what? I'd actually go for getting a flight to Turkey now. And cut, cut to me in Turkey in a mud bath and go, I feel like it. You know what we did? We went to Turkey, we put all the mud on. I've done it, it's called a mud rasul. Right, but then we did this. Like In the smell. Umata, umata, um. Note, this is umata, two naked people umata, putting mud on themselves umata. in a spa and... Alice and Carl did this. No, no, I did it when my mum and dad were away. Oh, bad. I was just saying, <laughs> you and Alice. Me and Alice doing the happy in the fucking hot to each other. <laughs> That's why it, it, the context. It was still believable though. <laughs> but, yeah, I was like, Alice doing the hacker. I'm not sure. But the reason why, do you know why I love you more? All right. So I went and got your food. I didn't even think to ask Alice and my mum. And then pulled up outside the office. I was like, Ah, oh, you're right. They were like, Yeah, yeah, good. Do you want any food? Yeah. I was like, It's too late. I was hoping you'd say no. Well, guess what? I've been mm. there all day. Hey. No problem. I've turned up twice today. Yeah. Hey. And here we I've are. I've turned up twice today. Here we are. We came, we saw, we conquered. Booming. Mate, today is the day that keeps on going. So, you know. Oh, sh Come on, in. Oh. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, are you on a call? Mm -hmm. Oh, thank God for that. <sighs> Sorry, I came bumping down the stairs. Um, this is the day that keeps on continuing. So, you know, I was telling you how the charger's not working. I'm like, ah, I can't change my bike for a ride tomorrow. Well, it's all Graham. And Graham, I don't know if he happens to be in the area or just wherever, has popped on round and lo and behold, He's come round with a spare charger. Introducing the one, the only, dun 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 dun, dun Graham Moore. Come with parts. <coughs> with people like this in my life, what else do I need? Yeah, so, I think it's that, it'll feel all loose it's, compared it's to loose that. It's loose goosey like. Yeah, you just had to pull that out. Where did you get this from? Did you just have a spare? Did you drive all the way there? That's 10 minutes from my house. Are you ready? I think it is that. Moment of truth. Will. It. Charge. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm in the... Oh. My bike's broke. Oh, my bike's broke. Oh, battery. no. My battery might be poofed. Oh, wow. There's loads of shit that's got in there. It's charging. Look at the station. Oh, it's charging. Yeah, Graham's a legend. Oh, no. So you got to physically take the battery out. Mate, the I have out. never taken that battery out to look behind that. That is dirty. Dirty. Mate, you can... Just for the record, Graham used to be a bike mechanic at races, so fixing yeah. stuff like... Well, maybe not an e-bike, but Same for fixing thing. things, he's fixed it. Also... Yeah, he does sell Wait, 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 wait. So he knows the script. What do you notice about the bike? It's got no battery. No, no, no. What do you notice about the bike? Go on. What do I notice about it? Summit's different. It can go even faster now, but what's different? I don't know. Come on, Graham. There's one thing that needed fixing on this bike. What was it? Come on. I don't know. It's more aerodynamic. That's the clue oh. I'm going to give you. <laughs> Ken, got, Ken was cutting screws down all day. No. We found a bolt to go in it. He did it, the lad. Look at this. It's a team effort on the bike. Go on. Team Syndicate original. I love it. Here, look. Look at his office. That's where he sits in his shorts. From here, you look naked, and he just sits there with his fake little background. It's meant, isn't it? That's quite great. This is Mondays at my house. He's supposed to do it from home, but he does it from here instead. Because this is his real home. Yeah. This is where he's loved. Whoa. Okay, that was a bit, uh, a bit too much. I am 100% having the most productive Monday I've ever had in my life. Ever. Ever, ever, ever. I don't even know what I'm doing at this stage. Just like that. Don't pull that. Are you going to be in your back? No, Jamie. You've never made a graffiti artist, would you? What? <laughs> Why do you say that? You'll sit back and sit. It looks great. What are you talking about? I did do Walter White. <laughs> Why are you making fun of my graffiti skills? Who's done that? You are, Harry Ellen. <laughs> You're a dick. I just thought I'd... Alright, maybe the smiley face is a bit strange, but whatever. Is it working? 
Oh, it's not. Yeah. Bike's broken. I changed it gold. You've got to create a tap. All right, draw a face then. Let's see what your face would look like. Not your face, but particularly. <laughs> mine was definitely not based off mine. Face. This is you're gonna tag up a wall with a face or a smiley face or something like that or a, or a drawing. I've run a face in years. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Okay, okay. I see what you're doing. Hang on. Oh, yep. No, I'm gonna have to edit this. Is that an ear or a nose or an eye? I don't know. I don't know. I'll be shit at drawing faces. It's a, from upside down, it looks like a ball sack. <laughs> That's definitely a set of tits now. That's a penis. Wait, are you drawing cats? <laughs> <laughs> Hang on a minute. That is absolutely bang on. What am I looking at? Ken's... Is that a monkey? Oh. <laughs> yeah. <there we> go. <laughs> it's a monkey. Yeah, there you go. So if you ever see this graffitied anywhere, it was him. Me. All <laughs> me. All me. Wow. That is just pure ass. What was worse? That? <laughs> oh, that. I paid it gold. <laughs> Why? All this. All this. Watch this. Can't do that. Rubbish bin. It won't take the kit. It's got to go to the general uh, recycling plant. Yeah, you have to take that to a recycling plant. I have to embarrass myself with that artwork. Go and get it back. Excuse me, it's not a carpet, it's a piece of art. Go and get it. And Ryan, do the GTA when he gets it out. Wasted. <laughs> I'm so glad Ryan's back because I wouldn't be able to do that. that that's flashing, in my opinion. It's fixed that. Oh, he's done it. Hey, thank you. And we have agreed a payment. Do you know what his payment is? That. He's had you off. He's had you off. Go ahead and just put you there and go to feed Stephen. Oh, Tom, what is that hoodie? Oh, god damn. Oh, god damn. God damn. Oh, oh, look, it's so fresh. I know, guys, soon. All right, that's all I'm saying. Soon, not yet, but soon. When? Not yet, but soon. Steve, how have you eaten this much food already? Get a fat the lizard, that's how. Jump, quick, it's jump out. I just open the lid like that, let them jump out, and I'm like, well, it's your funeral. You're about to be deaded. Enjoy your food. Good Stephen. Now feast. Ladies, have a great day. <laughs> See you later. All right, I completely forgot to order uh, Alice and my mum some food, so. And don't trust her in the slightest. Not, not even. Got that on camera. I want free sandwiches for life now. I'm assuming. Uh, I completely forgot to order Alice and my mum some food. Um, then I told them to ring up and order food, so they did. Yeah, about 40 minutes ago. So Alice's cheese sandwich has just been chilling there all that time. So sorry about that. Right, time to go to Syndicate Original. Bro, that spider just caught a fly and he's running off with him. What? Mate, he's cocooning him up. Mate, Mother Nature, you scary. Holy crap, you scary. Look, he's turning him into a spider dinner. Every time I get in this car, there's always a spider web here, and I always move it, and I never knew where the spider was. Well, turns out, now I do. Oh, look at him go. Look at him go. Oh. Oh, what's he doing to him? Oh, my God. Cal, get in the defender, mate. Get in the defender, mate. Oh, oh, shit. Oh my god, there we go, work it baby. Oh my god, Becky, that's it. Oh my god, where'd you get? I'm definitely gonna go through the roof of this defender. It, it hasn't got the, if it was a cat, it's. You can actually plastic. see it right there, just plastic. bending under his feet. Defender surfing! <laughs> Coming soon to Syndicate Original. Oh! Soon as long doing poses like this. Oh yeah, that's so edgy. What's the steel, the blue steel? Oh, oh yeah, oh, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh, look at that white strap, that leg. Oh, baby. Oh, oh did you just spank yourself? Oh, my God. This was the most productive Monday I've ever had. <laughs> In the history of Mondays. Yes, <laughs> hallelujah. <laughs> hallelujah to the Mondays. Hello, dog walker. Hello. <laughs> and release. Man, mate, we're doing photo shoots up here, guys. Look at this, ready? And the defender only. Oh, oh, skeet, 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 skirt. Tom, I can show what's on your ass. Oh, what's on my ass? What's on my ass? Look. Oh, my label! I didn't even see it! My label's sticking out! 
Was that the exact time? That was it. I didn't even know. It's not in the shot. Let's hope we didn't ruin the photo shoot. <laughs> we have limited time and resources. <laughs> we're having Ken's pants right now. Watch this. Come on. Come with me. Come here. We're having Ken's pants right now. Open that door. Come on. Open that door. Open that door. Open it. Come on. We're coming for you. Get that door open. Push it. Run away. I think he might be behind the door. Wait, check. Yeah. All right. Have you got one of these? That's it. Have you got one of these? Have you got one of them? Have you got one of these? In the van. Have you got one of these? In white. I said, have you got one of these? Full suit. Oh, full suit. You haven't got one of these, have you? Suit me the booty. I ain't got one of these. Why not? First time, I've never got something first. But why not? Know it. More the question, why not? I've got one and you don't. Go on, what is going on in here, Ken? Have you done any progress? you done any pro- You've put an entire one piece on? Jesus! Jesus! <laughs> Every time they get something new at Syndicate Original, I never get to see it first. My dad always gets it, or Carl gets it. I'm the first person to get hold of this tracksuit, man. The first, well, don't, don't, don't get me wrong, Evan Eckhard. By the way, can we get a shout out right now? Evan Eckhard. <laughs> killing it. Killing it. Absolutely killing it. Dude, the monogram looks so sick. Oh, I love it. I just love it. I want, with a brand, we want the S and the O, because look, it's an S and an O. People just think it's two chains. No, it's an S, look, it's an S and an O. The S and the O, and the lion to become one. So if you see the S and you know, O, oh, you know it's Syndicate Original. If you see the lion, then you obviously know. But damn, damn, damn. <laughs> Ready? Let's go back to the office. Come on, let's go. I'm having the most productive day ever and I want to fucking take <laughs> Shush. Whilst yeah. I'm here, uh, whoever your name is, Emily Mankello. Mankello. That's an amazing name. Yeah. Where from? Doncaster. Donny. The homie. Don't worry, I'm not going to just randomly give out your address there. Um, you've ordered yourself a hoodie. You know what? We're gonna do you, you're going to do you one better. Get a wristband. There you go. go. Nice. Black and gold. Throw that in the order. Where's the order? Get it in. Get it in. There you go. Sorry, you out. That's guys why you should always order from Syndicate Original. So I try and hook you up. Next on Tom's super long day of adventure, we are picking up my grandpapa Rino because we're going shopping. He needs some food. Just one grandino. How are you, Tom? I'm okay, my friend. No cane? No, no. cane? No. I got you, get in, let's go. All right, we're armed and ready with a list. Okay, liver, pies, fruit, cordial, orange. Cheese, lamb chops, pork chops. Don't be crashing into people. Have you ever seen such a big size butter in your life? <laughs> hey, we need oil. Man, you, bread goes off within like, you know, maybe five days or something like that. My granddad wants three loaves of bread. Okay. Would you like another flavor other than orange? As well? Yeah. What do you want? You want summer fruits? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, that's pink grapefruit. Beautiful. This way. <laughs> I was trying to hide from you. <laughs> Come on. We're going on. We just need potatoes and we're done. Nailed this trip. Mate, I'm that good at doing this trip now, aren't I? I'm, hey, hey, hey. I'm pretty good, aren't I? Come on now. Pretty good. Inside that, mate, you've got, you've got loads of food, loads of healthy food, all that. <laughs> what have I bought? Cereal and pizza. Yep, not a, not a good life for me. <laughs> I'll, I'll get by. Always look on the bright side of life. Go on, give us a whistle. Hey, what? Go on, go on. About the Blitz? Yeah. We, we literally were just singing, always look on the bright side of life, and then you started talking about the Blitz. Okay, then. I do love you. All right, we are going that way. Jesus, look at that, man. Look at that, man. Beauty. Absolutely. Beauty. Mate, I feel so grown up just uh, storing a pound there. Every time I get out, I can just go get a trolley. Booming. Did you ever hear about what sunk the Titanic? What? Come here. Come here. That bloody iceberg in your fridge. How long's that been growing for? <laughs> Don't come out. <laughs> I can imagine. That's the biggest icicle I've ever seen in someone's fridge. Yeah. That's why my margarine is always frozen. 
I put my margarine in there. And it freezes it. All right, maybe we need to lower the temperature by it. Maybe just a little, just a little bit. Just a little bit. I mean, raise it, sorry, but just a, just a little bit. There we go. Oh, flipping heck. Just like that. His fridge and his freezer are full. I've emptied the rubbish and he's got his stuff. How's that for you then? Look at that. The cleaners have done a smashing job. Beautiful, nice and clean like we expect. King's made absolutely killing the game. And uh, Grandad's got his uh, wizard stick. No, not exactly his. Wait, hold that, Grandad. Grandad, hold that. Let me have a look at you. All right, someone. Um, one sec, look, get, look, I'll take a photo of you. You shall not pass. <laughs> oh, really? It's also what Gandalf said, so if someone can edit that, please do. What a day. What a day. I can't believe it. And it doesn't end there. Oh. It doesn't end there. I'll tell you why. So, you know, I'm like a professional vlogger, like proper good cameraman and everything like that. Well, you know, I filmed uh, Chris and Hannah's wedding. Well, it turns out they paid some dude like 1,500 bloody quid to make him a big fancy proper wedding movie. Ooh, it's so good and so impressive. Um, I've seen his work, it's actually quite amazing. But ooh, this guy's so amazing, apparently he's worth 1,500 pounds. Don't pay me, did they? I had to pay to go to the bloody Reddit. No, actually, I didn't have to pay nothing. So, I, wait, did I? I don't think so. Uh, but, uh, but apparently, this guy made this uh, video. And uh, we're all going over to their house at 7 o'clock tonight to go and watch the premiere of the, of the Ashcroft wedding. So, uh, that should be good fun. I also need to decide on what colours. What colours I want my, my bedroom. Carl likes this for the panelling and then this from the doors. And I get it, a nice contrast of grey and white, but I'm more thinking this and that, which is not a contrast in the slightest, but I think it'd look sleek as tits, but I think it's a bit too, it's a bit too grey. So then I'm thinking the storm grey, storm grey, beautiful, and this. I think that looked pretty good, me. Played some blackout with Carl, and now it is time. Wonder what that beeping sound was. And now it is time for a bit of a live stream. Let's do it. Ah, right, ah, right, ah, right, live stream. How you doing? All right, playing Minecraft, live streaming it, loving life. I'm trying to see if these guys could do a drum roll. Look at that! Bloody perfect. That is an organised Twitch chat if I've seen one. Let the drum roll on. Oh, goddamn! We on that? We on that? 260 sub train. That means we've given away two T-shirts. So let's uh, let's draw a winner now. In five, four, three, two, one. Who wins? Grammy. Oh wait, sorry, no. <laughs> Gammy, Brammy. Congratulations, homie. Ooh, just walked out my house without my keys. Ah, that's awkward. It's really awkward. But yo, look, he's picking me up. Yeah. The Big tasty. What do you think? Oh, shit. Oh, what up? So you moving in with me? Yeah. <laughs> Tracks are a bit big for you, you know? Mate, he's hanging down my pants. I am a bogus gas man with fake ID and made a rancid grouse. There he is. I smell the blood. <laughs> oh, that word's shit. Oh, 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 almost had me. Almost had me. <gasps> there she is. Hello. Right, so I've just finished my live stream at home, and I thought, I didn't know it was going to go like this. The live streaming, the video from the wedding, from the videographer, on Facebook like a premiere. Whoa! This is gonna be, imagine if it's absolutely trash, if you got it, wouldn't you? <laughs> yeah, we're, we're, oh, did you, have you already seen it? Yeah. Oh, you spoiled it. Didn't work on the TV, so we're watching it on phones. Oh wait, Chris is the only one who's not working. Everyone else is. Oh! Wait, let me see, let me see. Oh, yeah. oh, there we go. Has it got sound? He just died, he's vanished. He got Thanos. Oh, he's back. You're like a peaky blinder. Mate, you look fresh as hell. Oh. <laughs> it was such a good wedding. Oh, stop it. 
Let's be. Oh. oh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, oh, Well, uh, <laughs> hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. What's going on here? What's going on? What have you done this for? <laughs> ah, look, she looks great. This is proper lovely. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you want a book? <laughs> oh. You are genuinely really photogenic. Seriously. Like proper. Oh, there's me vlogging. Both looks well good. Not that you don't now or anything like that. Like. <laughs> that was cracking. He killed it. He absolutely killed it. Hey, here he is. Whoa, <laughs> mate. I, my, by the way, my head completely fell off when we got to the end, and you were all stood on the stage, and we weren't supposed to be stood on the stage. I was like, where do I go? I was the last one, weren't I? I was shuffling. I was scan tripping over the dress. Aww, honey, he looks amazing. Imagine if you put your finger up his bum. <laughs> hey, all I'm saying is whack and, whack and Bessie. Hey, I know this is a bit harsh to say, but where's the Becky? Hey, if they're going to try and, try and get involved in the slightest, the bar is set. The bar is set. Serious? No, 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 no. Friendly, friendly, friendly. Well, um, okay. Well, one taxi driver brought me here and uh, another one's taking me. But what's going on, Pokemon? Just a new event that started. What tonight. do you have to do? Just new shinies have been released, mate. Well, what did you just catch? Is that shiny? I've hatched it. Is it shiny? No, is it heck? No way. Wait, if it actually rains in real life, it rains in the game? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's all changed now. What's hatching? Shit. Oh, I don't like the new Pokemon. I don't like the old ones. Got another one? No, no. See, right, show me your best Pokemon now. Let's see. How have they not raised know. the level cap yet? I don't know, mate. Right, your, fit, your best they're Pokemon. Not, not you have a Mewtwo? Yeah. Whoa. It's not that impressive, mate. Oh, right, okay. I'm oh, going right, off okay. it. <laughs> Alright, how much is it? £10, please. Are you taking. <laughs> nah, you just tip the bloody I can raise you. Man. Hey, I can raise you some some chicken tea on me. Do upset, you want it? It'll upset my stomach, mate. Really? Least, yeah. See, so he's what? gone, he's gone. Blowjob. <laughs> <laughs> Alright then! Jesus. And on that bombshell. Alright, I'll see you soon, alright? Ah, home sweet home. Forgot my key to my house though, so um, 
This is Operation Tom breaking his own home. I feel like 1.30 in the morning is the perfect time to end it. I've been streaming to like 5,000 to 6,000 people the entire time I've been streaming tonight, which is just mental. So thanks for all tuning in, guys. I do really appreciate it. Everyone's saying hello to the vlog as per. We, we've absolutely smashed it tonight. Earlier on when I did a quick stream, we hit like a 400 sub train. Now we're on 168 sub train, which is mental. We're planning new stuff to do on, uh, on Twitch with the Minecraft servers and stuff like that, which should be really really goddamn fun like seriously like absolutely smash that i'm well excited um but i'm really tired i'm hoping just to go get in bed put on netflix and just pass the hell out as trickster wang just gifted five subs in the chat because i'm trying to go to bed but he saved the train you're a but i appreciate it thank you well i can say that was one hell of an eventful day i don't actually know where i ended this possibly on a live stream but guys I'm so glad to be back, like proper daily vlogging. And I will say it is all possible because of Orion. So if we can get one like rain for the love of Orion, because he has saved us, he is what we need. And I just can't thank you enough. Again, congratulations with Benjamin in your life. But now you're back and you're mine. <laughs> I'm joking, but guys, thanks for watching. I'm gonna end the vlog here. Make sure you leave a like, rating, and click subscribe. I'll see you tomorrow at 7 p.m. for the next daily damn vlog. And don't forget, 9 p.m. every single day, new hunting optic episodes coming out on the gaming channel. So until tomorrow, guys, I love you, I'll leave you, and I'll see you next time. Adios.